Punishment and discipline are two different approaches to correcting child's misbehaviors. And it's important that parents know the difference between them. Hi, my name is Parson, family life coach with the Center for Fathering and author of The Modern Day Dad. Here are four key differences between punishment and discipline. Number one, focus. Punishment focuses on the past behavior, while discipline focuses on the future behavior. Number two, goal. Punishment aims to stop the behavior or make the child suffer for it, while discipline aims to help the child learn from their mistakes and make better choices in the future. Number three, relationship. Punishment can damage the parent-child relationship, while discipline can strengthen it. Number four, effectiveness. Punishment can be effective in the short term, but it may not teach the child how to behave differently in the long term. Discipline can be more effective in the long term as it teaches the child how to make better choices. Overall, discipline is a more effective and positive way to teach children how to behave. It helps to build a strong relationship between parent and child and teaches children how to make good choices in the future. Here is an example of how punishment and discipline can be used differently to address the same misbehavior. A child hits another child. The parent yells at the child and tells them to go to the room. That's punishment. For discipline, the parent helps the child to understand why hitting is wrong and teaches them how to resolve conflict peacefully. In the first example, the parent is using punishment to stop the child's behavior. However, the child may not learn why hitting is wrong or how to resolve conflict in a different way. In the second example, the parent is using discipline to help the child learn from their mistakes and make better choices in the future. Parents should strive to use discipline instead of punishment whenever possible. Discipline is more effective, builds a stronger relationship between the parent and the child, and teaches children how to make good choices in the future. Understanding the signs of child discipline is the third of 10 ways fathers can be effective in their role. To help fathers become effective dads in 2024, we will zoom in on 10 of the most essential aspects. Watch the next video to find out more. If you found this content useful, please subscribe to our channel and check out our website.